What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Tank B Chopping, and I'm back with another video. So check it out, guys. We out here at CT Barber Expo. Your boy got his hands on the new Snap FX, as y'all can see here. It's a big box. Uh, it comes with, we got the clipper and the trimmer in here. Uh, I did open it, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, I opened it earlier just to look at it, but I didn't take nothing out the box, didn't even read the specifications on it, nothing. So I just opened it, looked at it. So let's go ahead and get into this video on the actual unboxing of these clippers. Let's get it. Alright guys, so check it out once again, here is the box, as y'all can see, we got the Snap FX logo on there, so we're going to go ahead and open this thing up, I'm gonna drop this in here. so as y'all can see, we got the clipper and the trimmer in here, alright guys, so let's go ahead and start with the clipper, alright, let's check this out, so as y'all can see, here is the package for the, uh, the clipper, Y'all know how Babyliss does with the clipper packaging, guys. Looks really, really nice. Uh, we got, you know, the nice little uh, tin or the foil or the metal casing or the metal package that we always have when we get one of these clippers, like the regular gold FX, the metal FX, or the boost FX. So let's go ahead and read some of these specifications on the back before we actually open this thing. New LED ring light battery indicator. Snap in, snap out, dual lithium battery system, black DLC, fade blade, zero gap, and adjustable, snap on, snap off, self aligning magnetic hair pocket cover, new high torque 6800 RPM brushless motor, dual battery charging stand, 5D10 taper control, all metal housing, knurled barbell grip. So we we do have some of the things that we love from Babyliss in this clipper. You know what I'm saying? We still got the uh, the click lever on there. We got the little hanging ring at the bottom of the uh, the hanging hook on the bottom of the clipper. Uh, as y'all can see, it does look really similar to the to the metal FX. But the main thing about this clipper, guys, obviously being called the Snap FX, is we got dual batteries. So we got two batteries. So a lot of times when we buy a clipper, or me personally, when I buy a clipper that I really like, or if anyone buys a clipper that they really like, I always suggest that you buy two. That way when one dies, you can actually put, put that one to charge and use the other one. In this case, you don't need that. As y'all can see, we got two batteries in here. So let's go ahead and open this box and actually get into the unboxing of this. Y'all check that out. So as y'all can see, here are the two batteries, the clipper, we do get a charging dock for it this time. So let's go ahead and take this, let's go ahead and take the clipper and the charging dock out of here. So here is the clipper and the charging dock. We all take a look at that. As you can see, we got the fade blade on here. We got the click lever. Here is the charging dock. And as you can see on the charger dot, we got a spot for the clipper, and then we got two spots for the batteries. Let me show you all the batteries. So check it out, guys. Here are the batteries that go into the bottom of the clipper. So as you can see, you get the clipper, you get the battery, and you just push it in like so. The battery's in there. And now it's on. Then you just push these. We got two little buttons on the side, as y'all can see. Push that to take the battery out. So I think that's pretty dope. And the same thing with the other battery, obviously. You just push the battery in just like that. And then you push these two buttons on the side to take it out. So, like I was saying guys, the good thing about this is you get the charging dock that comes with a spot for the clipper to hold your clipper and then you get the two slots for the battery packs. So like I was saying earlier guys, the clipper is re is really never going to die. You know what I'm saying? As soon as it dies, you'll be able to put the other battery in there and charge the one that was dead. So it's going to stay charged 99% of the time. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a really good tool. I think it's a really smart idea to do that. Let's see what else comes in this box. So we also get some premium guards. I think that's really dope. You know, Babylist normally put the original guards uh, in most of their tools. So the fact that you can actually get this clipper with the battery packs, the charging dock, and the uh, the premium guards, I think that's pretty dope. And y'all know what comes standard with a lot of Babylist products. We get the little screwdriver, we get some oil. Uh, we also get another cam follower. 
And, that, and that's basically what we get in this box, guys. So that is the unboxing of the Snap FX Clipper. Once again, guys, check it out. Put that in like so. Pretty dope, pretty dope. So also, guys, another pretty dope thing about this Clipper is, y'all see this little face plate right here? You can actually take that off. And you can actually clean all this out with, with, without having to take your blade off. So a lot of times we get hair in this area of the clipper. So it's pretty tight that we can just take off this face plate and clean it out and then put it back on just like that. And it is magnetic. So you really don't have to worry about screwing it on, screwing it off. Uh, you just take it out, pop it back on just like that. Pretty dope, guys. So once again, guys, this is the new Snap FX from Babyliss. This is the clipper. I believe this clipper is going to be selling for $379. Not 100% sure. Wifey says she's pretty sure. We're not 100% sure. I do have the picture. I'm I'll post it in the video. Right, so. I'll post it in the video. What? I said I'm always right. Okay. She says she's always right. So uh, this clipper is going for about $379. And if it's not, I'll put the price somewhere up here once I actually uh, get to look at what the price is. Uh, that's basically it for the clipper. Let's go ahead and move that to the side and unbox the trimmer. All right, guys. So check it out. Here is the trimmer, the Snap FX trimmer. Let's read some of the specifications on the back. New LED ring light battery indicator, snap in, snap out, dual lithium battery system, all metal housing, knurled barbell grip, detent hanging hook, dual battery charging stand, new high torque 7200 RPM brushless motor, snap on, snap off face plate, and a, a black DLC deep tooth uh, T-blade. So let's go ahead and open this up. Y'all check that out. That is the trimmer. Once again, with the charging dock and the two batteries. So y'all check that out. We got the charging dock with the trimmer in there. Let's go ahead and get these batteries out. So same thing with the trimmer, guys. We got the batteries. We got the dual batteries. We just snap in and snap off. So as y'all can see, the battery's in there. Turn that thing on. Y'all check out the blade. We got the black DLC blade on there. And to take the battery out, same thing as the clipper. We press these two buttons on the side. Just pull it out like so. Here's the other battery. Do the same exact thing with it. Pop it in there like that. So same, same type charging dock, guys. Uh, you put the clipper in, or I'm sorry, you put the trimmer in there. And then we got it's got the, uh, the spots for the batteries. You just put them in, let them charge. Same thing with the trimmer, guys. It's not going to down you because you got one battery always charging. So once again, I think that's pretty, pretty dope. And uh, other than that, guys, I, I'm really excited to use these trimmers, use these clippers, and uh, really put them to use and see what they do, see how good the actual battery life is on these. And I believe the trimmer is going to be $279. Once again, guys, not 100% sure, but I will put the price on the screen somewhere. So let's go ahead and finish looking at what's in this, uh, what comes with the clipper, or I'm sorry, what comes with the trimmer. So y'all know... They always give you the zero gapping tool. We got a screwdriver. Uh, we got some oil in there. And then we got an extra cam follower. And that's basically it, guys. So once again, guys, here is the Snap FX clipper and trimmer combo. Detachable batteries on both. Uh, we got the fade blade on here. We got the DLC blade on here. Super quiet clipper. Super, super quiet trimmer. And y'all know how Babyliss does it, man. They got... They got some really good tools out there. Uh, the fact that they're doing this with the battery, once again, guys, I think is really smart, really, really just innovative, you know what I'm saying? Like, especially when you don't want to have a bunch of tools on your station, you don't want to have too many clippers on your station. This is super, super clutch. Uh, in my opinion, even though I haven't used it yet, I think this is a must cop because it is just something that's going to make barbering a lot easier for the barber. And I think that's really smart of Babyliss to do that. But once again, guys, here are the tools. Uh, just so y'all do know, the batteries are different sizes. So don't think that the trimmer battery will fit in the clipper battery and vice versa. So Babyliss did let me know that they are going to be coming out also with some batteries that are going to give more runtime. I believe these come with two hour runtime. Not 100% sure what the battery life on the trimmer is, but I know when I was talking to them at the booth earlier today, they said the battery life on the clipper on the clipper is two hours, I believe, but they are going to come out with a battery later on in the year that's going to give you more runtime. So they're not just giving us a dope tool now, but they're already looking to make it better in the future. And once again, guys, super dope with them. I think that's pretty tight with what they're doing. Uh, but that's basically it for this video, guys. Y'all check it out. Here are the tools, the brand new tools from Babyliss. Um, I'm sure I'm going to like them. I'm sure they're probably going to be one of my favorites uh, once I get back to the shop. 
But that's basically it for this video, guys. I don't know what else needs to be said about this. Uh, but yeah, man, I appreciate y'all for watching this video. If y'all like this video, please make sure to smash that like button. Also, if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe one time for your boy. And that's basically it, YouTube. I appreciate y'all for watching. Until next time, let's go.